In this video, I'm showing you how to download WinRAR and how to install it. If you do find this video useful, please go down below and hit the subscribe button, and then please go and leave a like as well, I really do appreciate it. WinRAR is a really awesome program, and without any further ado, let's go and get into this. Now let's go and get into this tutorial. Now WinRAR is a great program, it allows to open up compressed files, for example zip files, RAR files, and a load of other types as well. Now a quick note, I'll be also be showing you how to activate it as well, so do keep watching as you may not immediately be able to open up certain files using WinRAR, I'll be making sure you can go and do that. Now, the first thing we need to do is go and download it. So what you want to do is simply go and open up your search browser and simply search for WinRAR. I'll be showing you the full install process as well. And then all you want to do is come to WinRAR.com. Now as you're here, you want to go and click download. Now WinRAR does for a free trial, which is really cool. So click download WinRAR. And it's going to go and take you here and you can come to the bottom and click download WinRAR. You don't have to buy it as you're getting a free trial. Now, as you can see, it's now gone downloaded. It's a really small download. Now let's go and click on it and you're going to get a Windows security pop up, which my screen recorder will not record. Then it's going to go and bring up the installer and we can close off Chrome and let's go and run through this. So what you want to do is make sure you read this and then go and click install. Then it's going to go and install it for you. And there are a few things you need to decide. Here, you need to go and decide where you associate WinRAR with. Personally, I don't associate it with JAR, simply because I like to run JAR files. I don't want to open them up within uh, WinRAR, so I personally have that unticked, and the rest are going to be um, personal preference. Then, what we want to do is we'll click OK, and as you can see, WinRAR setup. WinRAR has successfully been installed to the folder, you can go and click done. Now as you can see, this zip file has gone and turned to the WinRAR logo, meaning when we double click on it, it's going to go and open up WinRAR. If you don't have this option, what you want to do is click on it once, then right click, and you're going to get this list here, and you'll click open with. As you can see, you'll then be given the options for WinRAR and Windows Explorer. So if at the minute it's not opening up using WinRAR, you can simply go and change it with this open with tool, um, and that's really useful. So now I want to quickly show you how you can go and use WinRAR. So as you can see, I've got the zip file once again here. You want to click on it once and then you can right click and you've got these options here. You can extract the files here. So if I click here, it's going to go and create a whole new folder. I'll click OK. It's going to go and create a new folder with all those in which is no longer compressed. And there you go. I can then go and open up and they're all going to be there. And you can also go and click extract here and it's not going to go and create a new folder. Honestly, that's pretty much what it does. You can also zip files using it, I'm pretty sure, as well. Um, but yeah, that's pretty straightforward. So if you did find this video useful, please go down below and hit that subscribe button. Leave a like, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.